Hello, and welcome to Crazy Land. Today, we are going to explore the tea industry and plantations in Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka, formerly known as Ceylon, is a beautiful island nation in South Asia, renowned for its tea plantations, which produce some of the world's best tea. The history of tea plantations in Sri Lanka dates back to the 19th century. It all began when a British planter named James Taylor arrived in Sri Lanka and started experimenting with tea cultivation. He soon realized that the country's hilly terrain and climate were perfect for growing tea. Today, Sri Lanka has more than 200,000 hectares of tea plantations, which produce around 300 million kilograms of tea annually. The tea cultivation process begins with the selection of the right tea bushes and planting them at a proper distance. Tea plants require ample rainfall and cool temperatures, making Sri Lanka's central highlands the perfect location. Once the tea leaves are harvested, they are taken to the factory for processing. The leaves are first withered, then rolled to break the cell walls, which releases the tea oils and aroma. The leaves are then left to ferment and oxidize, which is what gives the tea its flavor and color. Finally, the leaves are dried and sorted according to their size, shape, and quality. Sri Lanka produces several types of tea, such as black tea, green tea, white tea, and oolong tea. Black tea is the most commonly produced and exported variety, and it is known for its strong, robust flavor. Green tea, on the other hand, is lighter and more delicate, with a grassy flavor. White tea is the rarest and most expensive variety, known for its subtle, delicate flavor. The tea industry is a vital part of Sri Lanka's economy, employing more than one million people directly and indirectly. It is also the country's second largest export after textiles. The tea industry has helped uplift the living standards of many Sri Lankans, particularly those living in rural areas. Apart from its economic benefits, the tea industry also attracts many tourists to Sri Lanka. Visitors can tour the tea estates, learn about the tea-making process, and even taste some of the best teas in the world. The scenic beauty of the tea plantations, with their rolling hills and misty valleys, is also a major draw for tourists. In conclusion, the tea industry and plantations are an integral part of Sri Lanka's history, culture, and economy. The industry has helped the country develop and prosper while also attracting tourists from all over the world. So, the next time you sip a cup of tea, remember that it might have come all the way from Sri Lanka. Thank you for watching Crazy Land, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more exciting content.